Hello everybody, I am Nico D. So I am back making videos about SBCs and today we are gonna take a look at Vex Emu. So Vex Emu is an emulator for x86 programs on ARM64. So it is only for 64 bit x86 programs, so AMD64, to run on ARM64. So it is just like Box64, which also does the same. But with Vex Emu, I've got more luck with some games that didn't work with Box64. So I have shown Box64 and Box86 in earlier videos. So now's the time to take a look at Vex Emu. So first of all, I wanted to play this game. So Edgecraft, it is one of my favorite games. I can build it for ARM64 if I needed it. But why would I if I just can download the x86 version and run that? So first of all I've downloaded Edgecraft and I will try it with Box64. And it doesn't work. So that's why I thought let's try it with Vex Emu. So now let's install Vex Emu. So we go to the GitHub from Vex Emu. And here we do this. It is all we need to do. And now follow what it says. So always yes. And extract. It is that simple. But this is only for Ubuntu. So I am using Armbian Jammy. So that is Ubuntu 2204. And it works just fine on here. I am using the Oldroid N2 Plus to do this. So while it is installing I can show you this. So these are some benchmarks Petitsep from Box86 and Box64 has done. So here he compares Kimu x86 with Fex x86 and Fex64, Box86, Box64 and native ARM HF and Arch64. So here you can see that Box86 and Box64 do perform better, but not always everything will work on it. So it is very good to have other choices. You do need enough disk space to use this because it does take a lot of disk space. It is using a full x86 Ubuntu image to do this. So that's why it takes up a few gigabytes. Now that it is installed, we see what we have to do. So to run something we can do fix bash and then the program name or we can run fix bash on itself. So that's what I'm gonna do. I am already in the directory that I need to be. So all I do is type fix bash and it is case sensitive. So do it right Nico. So now all I need to do is the same that I did to try it with box 86. So that is run this file, Edgecraft. And if we wait a bit, then we see that it works. I didn't notice that I didn't capture the sound, so there is no sound here, but the sound does work. I am using another display and it is using DVI. And I think that's why it didn't capture the sounds. But well, so this works. So let's try another game, another one that also can be built for ARM64 and also one of my favorites, but it is a heavy game to run on an SBC. So Xonotic, so I've downloaded Xonotic from the Xonotic website and then I tried to run it. It took a long time before it ran, but it did work, but it was way too slow to be usable. So that's it for today. So Flex Emu can be used to run x86 games on ARM64 and it can also run x86 programs. Experiment a bit with it. If something doesn't work with Box64 then you can try Flex Emu. I am working on new benchmarks for all my boards. So when the Rock 5 arrives I can immediately start working on that. So that's what I'm waiting for. And I will also review my first RISC-V board soon. 
So I'll subscribe for that. Thank you all for watching. See you all later. Bye.